What's going on everybody? Pappy here at West Georgia Rods and Customs. Hope everybody's having a great weekend. We definitely have been. Our weather finally opened up. We had rain all day yesterday, Saturday, and it was just a miserable day. Nothing better to do but just sit in the house, uh, either get a little bit of modeling done, or just sit around watching college football like what we did later on yesterday evening. Uh, unfortunately, of course, if many of you call, follow college football like I do, my, my number four Bulldogs lost to the number one Crimson Tide. God, man, I tell you, that was a hell of a game. Really enjoyed it, but unfortunately, uh, they knocked us out right there at the at the fourth quarter, and, uh, you know, true Alabama style, they dominated. But anyhow, congratulations to the Crimson Tide. Uh, at least we got an SEC team in there fixing to go to the uh, college football playoff. Georgia still holds, you know, they still could possibly pull it out, but... You know, you know how the college football playoff thing goes. You know, they're all biased and love Alabama, but, you know, at least we've got an SEC team in there, and I uh, hate to say it, but hope, hopefully next year we'll be in there in the running again. But uh, another thing that we did yesterday, we got a little bit done around the house. You know, I helped Vicky clean up the house a little bit, getting ready for the football game. But I needed some supplies over at Hobby Town, so I walked, run over there real quick and, uh, come back, I go with a, probably a list of three things to get and I come back with all this. Uh, one thing in particular, which working on the 55 Cami, uh, Cameo pickup, of course we're going with the white and red theme. I needed a can of, uh, uh, of red, so I had to go pick up a can of red spray paint to go in conjunction with the white right there. So hopefully today it war it's warmed up, so I may get some paint sprayed today. I also had to get some of the uh, all clad. Uh, I'd run out of the gloss black base coat and the uh, and the clear uh, that goes over that, and I needed to go ahead and just get a refreshment bottle of uh, the chrome. Got a got some chrome, and I need to do on that front grill. So got it all stripped down. I'll show you that in a minute. Another product that I walked out with was the novice uh, 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 the novice polishing system. I've heard heard nothing but praises about this, and I'm gonna. I'm gonna try it, uh, I'm gonna use it on this particular bill. Be the first time I've ever used it. So I went ahead and got all three as far as the uh, the plastic clean, the fine, number two there is the fine scratch remover and the heavy, number three is the heavy scratch remover. So I went ahead and got that and got that in conjunction with their polishing cloths right here. They give you a couple in the, uh, in the, in the kit right there, but I went ahead and bought another pack of these uh, just to use, cause they, they, they like for you, it, it's not as abrasive uh, with these cloths right here. Uh, using that so I thought I'd give them a try as well had some other paints I needed to pick up as far as some uh, some to my brush paints and uh, uh, To work on this 55, but I'm hopefully going to get a lot done today as far as uh, May get the body painted uh, get the base coat of white on there and get started with it Let me pause this just for a minute and I'll give you an update on what's going on on the uh, on the camera well, There's the truck all subbed up. That's what she's going to kind of look like got the stance wanted for what I need uh, as far as uh, How she's got that downward rake to it. She slammed to the ground. I'm really enjoying this bill uh, Got the bed uh, y'all saw a lot of the bed. I got the bed finished out got it ready to pop down in there uh, got the radiator core support, uh, got the radiator and all, got it painted up. There's the interior panel. Uh, got a lot of the interior, almost finished with it. Still got to do the uh, finished up, painting up the uh, uh, the steering wheel. I got a, I'm got. i going to put a uh, aluminum drive, uh, aluminum uh, steering column down through there, so I'm going to build that after a while. Got all the seat belts. That's just kind of mocked up right now, but got the uh, interior panel uh, as far as the dash and all that done, console. Got it sitting in there, so I'm gonna get all of it finished up today. Got some of the uh, smaller parts done. Got a battery and a uh, battery sitting over there. I'm gonna have to detail that out here pretty soon. But uh, went and got the all clad finished up. The uh, uh, there's the the grill. Got it all stripped down. So I get I get the all clad shot base coat shot down on it, and uh, hopefully this thing will pretty much well won't be too far along uh, getting it done. Those right there in front of the uh, uh, in front of the front of the bumper right there. Those are two little speakers I found on a die cast. So I popped them out and we're going to be putting those into the uh, into the door panels right there. Just kind of give them a little mocked up look, kind of looking a little bit more uh, modern. That's what I was trying to shoot for was a little more modern look with the, uh, uh, as far as on the interior and as far as like on the, uh, uh, on the inside of the, 
inside there. Let me set that aside. There's the uh, there's the little bit more modernized engine right there as far as uh, going inside the uh, engine compartment. So won't be too long. We're uh, we're rocking right along. Hopefully this thing will be finished up and get all the chrome on it. Get all the pretty little uh, jewelry as I like to call it as far as the chrome bumpers and chrome accent and the chrome trim around the top. Get all that done. Going as far as with the color uh, color choices on this, uh, gonna go, of course, let me get Scully, give me a hand here. Uh, of course, all the white, this entire, everything will be white down through here. The red trim uh, right in here, all that, that little piece right in there will be uh, red. And then the in, inside of the bed itself, of course, the, uh, this as far as, uh, as far as the, uh, wood grain floor, of course, it'll go in here, but I'm gonna get all this taped off up here and this will all be shot red. Sides and everything will be red, a little bit of red going up here and then with a chrome accent going across the top. Back of the uh, tailgate, of course, this is the front of the tailgate, what, what you'll see outside, but the back side of the tailgate, it'll be red as well. Anywho, that's where we're at. Let me get my big finger out of the way. I was blocking that, but that's everything. Hopefully, uh, hopefully everything will be coming along here pretty quickly. So weather permitting today, gonna get some all clad shot, uh, get the base uh, first base of uh, white on the truck, get it a little bit shinier. And uh, then once all that dries, get the red shot and then be throwing the clear on it here pretty soon. I'll keep y'all posted. Hope everybody has a great rest of your weekend. God bless y'all. Remember, if you can dream it, build it, pappy out.